Hello Cancer, welcome to a bonus love reading for the month of January 2021. As always, this is a general love reading, so it will not resonate with every Cancer watching. If this does not resonate with you, don't try to make it fit. Just check out my other uh, videos for Cancer. You can get to my playlist by clicking on my username here, and it'll take you to my homepage, and you can scroll down, and I have all of the playlists there for every sign. You might find something there might, that might resonate for you. Um, if this does it resonate for you, don't forget to leave me a comment. Let me know. I'd love to hear from you. And we're just going to jump right in. All right, for Cancer. I'm using my new Stellar Energy Oracle deck. This is the physical version of my digital deck that's already available in my shop. I love this deck. It has some changes. Um, some of the pictures and messages are the same. Some are completely different. Um, I'm not sure if I want to put this in the shop yet. We'll see. But you will see it in videos. So let's see. All right. Um, for Cancer, for Cancer. Spirits, angels, guys. What messages do you have for Cancer in love? January 2021. What do they need to know regarding love? What does Cancer need to know regarding love? That's way too many. What does Cancer need to know regarding love? January 2021. Okay, we got pure seduction, lust, temptation, desire. You're being tempted to give in to your desires. And then we have sudden realization, clarity, truth, epiphany. A sudden realization has brought new clarity. Someone's gotten clarity about what they truly want. Um, I feel also like this is someone that has, yeah, I was going to say, there's been a change. I have falling leaves at the bottom here. This is uh, changes, transition, time. Time changes everything. So over time, someone has changed their mind or has had sudden realization about what they truly want here. So let's see. What messages do you have for Cancer Spirit for January 2021? What does Cancer need to know? What does Cancer need to know? Okay, we got the Fool, something new here, and the Moon. Pisces energy with the Moon, something unknown. It's almost like someone wants a new beginning but has no idea like what the journey will, wow, and then we got Justice. So all major arcana is here for you libra energy with justice so some sort of new beginning here but it's like there's something that's unknown um something that could be an illusion here or is hidden in some way but i feel like whatever happens there's a final decision or justice will come to you will get justice so it will be fair and balanced to you um, you could be dealing with a libra a pisces does not have to be but there's something new here happening a risk someone might be taking a risk here what's this fool about why is the fool here temperance reverse okay so again with time sagittarius energy another major arcana so these are major energy shifts here cancer so temperance reverse tells me that there's something that's been in the works for a while it has not officially come together more time is needed or more effort is needed or something's just still off balance so i feel like there's a progression here something is off balance right now but eventually it will balance out tell me more about the fool the emperor reverse what in the world is going on with these major arcanas yeah something here has been out of someone's control or someone has felt powerless like this is out of their hands. They cannot stabilize or make something happen here. Aries energy with the emperor. Maybe that's why this is requiring a risk here or a complete change with the fool. Tell me more about the fool. The lover, oh my God, <laughs> the lover's reverse. So this is all major arcana so far. Um, Gemini energy there. It's like all of them also are like one sign practically. So something has not worked. Okay, so basically what this is telling me, what Spirit is telling me here is that this is in regards to a person, a choice. 
um, a choice in partner. Uh, maybe this is a partnership that has not worked out up till now. There has been an imbalance. Maybe someone has been stuck uh, due to fear or obstacles or something else. Um, a new choice needs to be made. There's regret over an existing choice and a new choice needs to be made. That's why we have the Fool here and the Sudden Realization card with Falling Leaves, Changes, Transitions. There's a change happening in a connection. Tell me about the moon. Why is the moon here? Ten of Pentacles. Interesting. Long-term stability, success, financial security, family. Tell me more about the moon. Why is the moon here? Four of Wands reverse, <laughs> the complete opposite. So with this, okay, I'm getting a few messages here. Tell me more about the moon. There's like a lack of harmony in a home, lack of, there's no balance, there's no harmony, there's no peace in a home. Um, perhaps this could also be that there's delays here in getting that stability. This is also telling me that for some of you, this could be you or your person, but there on the outside, everything looks good, but inside it's not very stable. Tell me about the moon. The moon also is about illusions. Three of cups. Why is the three of cups here, Cancer? <laughs> three of cups is about celebrating, reunion, coming together, friendships celebrations net like events marriage it's like it's like someone wants to come together in secret or there's some sort of illusion about something to do with like a group of people what in the world's going on why is the four of wands hold on didn't even ask my question why is the four of wands reverse Spirit. Why is the Four of Wands reversed here? Page of Pentacles. Money? Why did I think money? Someone could be waiting for money or needs something to do with money here or an opportunity. Tell me more. Why is the Four of Wands reversed? Because justice is here to fix something. So there's something that's off here. Five of Cups reverse. Regaining what's been lost. There, someone could have had a loss in, in finances or a job or there's regrets. Someone is wanting to recuperate something. The Hangman reverse. This is strange. I, I'm not going to. This is strange because the hangman is someone who does not want to sacrifice or cannot let go of something. Uh, they're, they're stuck because they don't want to give something up. This could also be someone that's stubbornly like in a situation. So I don't know why the hangman is here. What's in the bottom of the deck? The emperor's reverse. Okay, so this could be a person. Four of swords. This could be a person that is um, keeping someone from taking action. There's, there's a waiting period here. So there's a waiting period here regarding a new opportunity is what I'm seeing. And the opportunity is regarding regaining something or getting back something that they've lost, overcoming difficulties from the past, overcoming disappointment. Someone could be messaging you, this card, Page of Pentacles, you, typically I don't think about like an actual message, but in this card, this this woman has a is writing a message. 
I'm, I'm getting it's like someone's been planning something um, looking at the details contracts something like that someone's been planning something this could be legal with the justice card here and it could have something to do with three people um, or a group of people um, this could be co-workers family friends whatever this is because I have an Empress reverse so I feel like there's someone involved here who's not completely happy or who won't be happy with someone's new choice let's see why is the justice card here why is justice here justice is here to make things right this could be a legal decision a legal situation or just things becoming balanced yes the fighting is over the drama is over with the five of wands reverse someone has won this fight nine of pentacles yes and they're doing very well alone the hermit at the bottom here virgo energy this is like single single energy someone's like single or independent justice has allowed someone to be free to figure their next steps to figure out what's next tell me more about justice can get one more page of cups yeah this could be somebody that is ready for something new this is new energy bottom of the deck I have the two of pentacles and the page of swords and the nine of cups wow for everyone wondering if my deck is all reversed it's not <laughs> I keep getting those comments half of the deck is reversed you're holding it upside down no I'm not it's whatever cards are meant to come out someone could be talking to you this could be somebody new talking to you cancer or expressing themselves to you in a way I feel like they're going back and forth on how to talk to you now that they're free of something what's next what's next spirit for cancer What's next for this connection here? What's next? What's coming next? Nine of Swords, Eight of Wands, Reverse, Three of Wands, King of Swords, Page of Wands, Reverse. What's next? Someone's scared. Six of Swords. There's some sort of a transition here with the Six of Swords, a move. And I have the Queen of Swords at the bottom. So I have the King of Swords and the Queen of Swords here. This is um, clarity, clarity, truth. This is someone that knows exactly what they're going to do. This is someone that communicates openly and directly. This is someone that does not have time for the BS. They see right between the lines. So I feel like this is someone that has seriously planned a departure. This is someone that has really thought things through. And the Queen of Swords is someone that um, they don't let anybody get in their way. Uh, they don't think about emotions. I mean, they don't think about decisions in an emotional way. They're very um, unemotional, actually, when they, when they speak, when they think, when they plan. Emotions don't get in the way here. So this is someone that has really thought things through about a departure about leaving a situation. I feel like there's gonna be delays uh, with the Eight of Wands reversed, the Three of Wands reversed, and Page of Wands reversed. This is delay, delay, delays. This is someone that could, you know, that's probably where the fear and the anxiety comes from. But the King of Swords is here. This is someone that's gonna cut out anything that's in their way. And that is part of the change here. So there's a change happening for someone, either you or the person you're dealing with cancer. This could also be for those of you who haven't even met this person, but they're coming your way because there's the fool here, page of cups, this is new energy. So this could be someone that's wrapping things up right now in order to make their way towards you, you know, to meet you in some path here. All right, Cancer, I'll leave it there. Hopefully this reading resonated for you. Leave me a comment if it did. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe if you enjoy my readings and want to see more. And I'll see you all in another video. Take care.